Hello, everyone. Welcome. Happy Sunday. Hello, hello. Come on in. Welcome. Hey, Brad. How are you? Happy Sunday to you. How are Moon, Shadow, Stardust, and Lyric? I just got back from church. I did too. I ran over a little bit today. Um, maybe about close to a half hour because I went on and uh, did the suggestion you had and had Breezy to um, do an announcement. We're still working on it, though, so I'll probably will post it next week, um, probably the day after or either two days after we do the Pantone Color of the Year video with my makeup group. At least that's my plan. I just fixed Mr. G a little bite to eat right quick. And I'll probably just fry some chicken when I'm done here. <laughs> just waiting for some people to come into the room so we can get started. I should have um, put my reminder up before I went into church. That was my intention. And we got to church faster than I thought today. <laughs> Let's see what you're saying here. That's so cool. Yep. Mm hmm. Yep, I think she she was nervous a little bit. You'll see. Um, I did like two takes of her, you know, trying to do the announcement. And she's going to try to do one more at home and then uh, email it to me. Just email me the file. Hey, Chica, 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 how are you, hon? Welcome. Good to see you. Red says, do you believe Moonshadow has a Beagle girlfriend? I had to take him to the pet store to get her a Valentine's Day gift and car. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So where did uh, he meet her? On your walks? That's funny. Sometimes I think like pets are kind of like people in their own way. They just can't like communicate with us verbally, but they know when they do something wrong because they'll hide or hold their head down and walk away like real slow. Uh, my dad's dog used to do that. Um, I took over the dog because it was a little bit too much for him. And so I had Bandit for maybe a year and a half. And uh, she passed away. It's a, it's a, it was, I think it was a year on the 21st of this month 
there is my girl hey josh hi michelle hi ladies it's so good to see you happy new year red says hi josh Chica says, I am good, and it's good to see you, too. Yep, I'm going to cam up in one minute. I was just drying a couple of dishes off right quick, <laughs> so my background won't look too crazy. Josh says, wait a minute, let me see. I think I skipped one. There you go. Josh Loves Beauty says, mine always comes to me whenever I'm sad. Oh, see, they can sense things. They can really sense things. That's why people have the CNI dogs and they have companion dogs because they sense things because they get to know the person they're with. Red says, yes, on his walk, Stardust is too young to get a boyfriend. How old are the dogs? Because they look just alike to me. I was thinking they were like around the same age because of their size. Hey, Cherry. Hey, girl. Good afternoon, lovely ladies. How are you, hon? Welcome. If you guys don't know each other, get to know each other. Cherry is so sweet, has so much energy. I just love her channel. Josh says, uh, Happy New Year. It's great to see you too. Yes, yes. Hey, V, Simply You Makeup. I am here listening. I am here shampooing my hair. Okay, honey. All right. Well, it's good to have you all in the room. And I'm getting ready to cam up. Just put that silverware in the drawer. Let me see. Yep, I guess everything looks okay now. <laughs> mm. Let's see. Josh says, hi at Cherry. Cherry says, all is well. Thank you. Red says, Stardust is two, Moonshadow is seven, and Lyric is nine. Really? Okay, I didn't know Moonshadow was that old. Cherry says, hi to Josh. Now, Josh, she doesn't have a channel, but she is sweet as pie and a very good supporter. Josh says, hi, it's Simply You Makeup. It's so good to see you ladies. Okay, so, oh shoot. I'm gonna cam up and then I'm gonna run and get my uh, soda right quick. Let me start my camera. Okay, and I'm gonna take this one down. Hold on one second. Okay, I'll drink tea instead. My refrigerator is packed, so it's cold in Detroit. I use my front porch. Let's see. Let me go back up and catch my comments. Josh says, oh, thank you. I try. Yep, you do. This is just my first time seeing you this year. Hi, Amazing Space Music. Welcome. Greetings from Finland. Oh, my goodness. Well, welcome. And what time is it in Finland? Hey, Spirit. Hey, my love. It's good to see you. How are you? 
so good to see you. Josh says, welcome, Olavi. Josh says, hi, at Spirit. Yep, it's good to see you guys. I um, You guys know I love this cup because my dad gave it to me. So I take it to church um, just so I can have a little something to wet my whistle. And I kicked it. And I went to grab it to get some. And the cup was laying on the side. I'm like, oh, well, it's in the carpet now. So now I need paper towel to kind of like absorb it. And so I needed to refill it with something. Let's see. Let's see at that. Spirit says, I'm Will. Thanks. Always good to see you. Spirit says, hi, Josh. How are you doing, love? All right. Okay. So today's topic was on the ingredients that are in like the typical skincare products that you use. Um, do you guys look for anything in specific or do you have a favorite product? If you do, can you please type that in the comment section so I can see what you have going on? Josh says, I'm good. Thank you for asking. How are you? Red says, guess what? I've won the Jeffree Star cremation palette. Are you serious? That's a very interesting palette. Congratulations. That's cool. Josh says, who at red? Jeffree Star. Who is a, a very talented makeup artist. And has videos on YouTube, but uh he's uh really big in the industry so he has a lot of sponsorships and also does things that are not on youtube with various companies josh says i love the ordinary let's see josh says it's inexpensive and really works uh, so you like ordinary products um is is that the name of the product the ordinary olavi says today you live chance dr phil haha -ha. okay all right finland Josh says, yes, the ordinary. I've never heard of it. I'm going to type it in my search bar and then see if I can share my screen. Okay, the ordinary. They have a peeling solution, uh, niacinamide, and then they have Salic acid mask, they have a hair serum, they have hyaluronic acid, concealer, retinol, and the ordinary vitamin C. So let me do this. The ordinary skincare shop at Sephora. So, all right. Okay, so hold on, guys. I pulled up the page. And I'm going to, um, let's see. Josh says, everything is in between $5 and $10 and works amazingly well. They sell it at Sephora and Ulta. Okay. 
Bless 2021. Okay, Finland. All right. Amazing space music. Okay, so let me share my screen. Share screen, Chrome tab, the ordinary, share. Okay, and I'm just going to check back to see if you guys can see it. Yep, let me take this one comment away. There we go. Okay, so let me close this. I don't want you to know where I am, uh, Sephora. 50% off, save on a new skincare pick every day through 125. So that's tomorrow while supplies last. Um, so here's some of their products here. And they have different uh ingredients and uh different compounds in it niacinamide 10 percent zinc one percent and this first one here the ordinary but i'm going to see what this is this very first one hmm five dollars and ninety cents for one ounce and this looks like some type of drops. Where is the description? Close. Oh, they got a little video. Oh, pictures. Oh, there's the video. I don't know if my computer has enough memory to run the stream yard and this. I don't think so. So I'm going to close that before I get into trouble. Now I'm going to go back and make sure you guys are still here. Yep, you're still here. So let me go back and read this to see if there's a description um highlights niacinamide oil free it's vegan without silicones cruelty free and community favorite about the product which skin type is it good for it says normal oily combination dry and sensitive what it is show more that's what I wanted. Okay, what it is is a high strength vitamin and mineral blemish formula with 10% pure niacinamide and 1% zinc PCA. Solutions for oiliness, pores. If you want to know more, niacinamide, which is vitamin B3, reduces the appearance of skin blemishes and congestion. A high 10% concentration of this vitamin is supported in the formula by zinc PCA to balance visible, visible aspects of serum, ser sebum activity. Sebum activity. What is that? Okay. What is formulated without? It does not have parabens. It does not have sulfates. It does not have... Bifolates, bifolates, bifolates. What else you need to know? This product is vegan, cruelty free, and formulated without alcohol, silicone, nuts, gluten, and fragrance. All right, so this is for blemishes. So, is that the one you use? Josh, or is it a different product? Let me come back up here. I had dark spots and the vitamin C did its thing. Okay. Oh, I should get something. I wonder if it would work on the dark spots I have from wearing glasses. I think I'm going to check into that then. Baking soda when cancer maybe. Okay, 
Josh says, also the ordinary red pilling solution is everything. So it's like a chemical peel. My skin is real sensitive. I probably would be scared of that one. There are some serums to wear under your makeup, plus a foundation that already has the serum in it. So you get a two in one. Wow. I wonder how extensive the shades are. I wonder how many shades they have in the makeup. Let's see. Josh says sebum is pimples or blemishes. Okay, thank you, baby. Thank you. So that's the one product. And you said the vitamin C one. So let me go back. And find the one with the vitamin C. Hmm, they got a lot of products. <laughs> Here we go. This is one with the ordinary vitamin C suspension, 23% HA spheres, 2%, $5.80 online only. So I'm going to click this one, then I'm going to come back to you guys and see if this is the one that you say helps you with the dark spot. So let me go back to the stream yard. V says hello to everyone. Red says hello. Simply you make up. Simply you make up says I have the ordinary pilling solution. Okay. So you guys, there's two people that know about it. Red says I need to be careful with my eyeshadow products because I get very bad rashes on my eyes if I use the wrong product. Wow, Red. Uh, one of the girls um, in my group, Michelle Brown Brows, um, she has to be real careful with some of the Juvia's Place eyeshadow palettes. Um, some of the ingredients in certain shades, not all of them, have something in it that they have on the box. Uh, they have a warning saying, do not use around your eyes. <laughs> You making an eyeshadow palette, and she has a couple of videos up about it. So I don't understand why you would make it if it's gonna cause a, a problem to people's eyes. But it just doesn't make sense. Let's see. Josh says there are a lot for women of color. I'm actually. I actually found mine. They have you take a picture of yourself that matches you perfectly. Really? So you definitely have to get that done in the Sephora store. If they take a picture of you because uh, when I got the Fenty product, they um, went on the computer and typed in what I like to use, what matches my Estelada double wear. And so then they uh, correlated it some type of way to match the shades from the Fenty line with the computer. So I found that interesting because I was expecting for her to pull out the device that they hold against your skin. It looks like a little gun and um, then they can get your shade from that. That's how I got my double wear. It was, you know, perfect. Um, that little device held against my skin. Josh says, are you hooked like I am? And simply you make up. <laughs> Red says, I was discriminated at Target. Are you serious, Red? Girl, Josh says, no, on your phone with lighting. Oh, okay. 
So I take my picture myself and just use it in their uh, software program. Now that is like almost like outer space. <laughs> I forgot I had stuck this up here. Somebody gave me their telephone number at church and I put it in my other pocket. I'm like, what is this? <laughs> that is cool. Josh says, what at red, that's horrible it is. And I'm sorry that that happened to you. Um, I want to say. Yeah. It was last, it was last week. Was it last week? Yeah, I want to say it was last, maybe like. Wednesday. So no, it was week before last. The day after I had my injection. I um experienced a act of hate. Um at my grocery store. And we had just been talking about like some Sephora's you know people have discriminated against like women of color like you shouldn't be in here you don't have um the money or you might be trying to steal type of thing which is kind of sad v says another good one i am hearing uh dermatology talking about is inky Inky. Josh says people are so rude. I rarely go out. Yeah, it's it's kind of sad. Red said a staff accused me of stealing a vacuum cleaner. He held me up from leaving the store. He thought I couldn't afford to pay it because I was dressed down. That's horrible. It might, if you were going to steal a vacuum cleaner, vacuum cleaners are kind of large. So where were you supposed to be hiding a big, I almost said something, <laughs> a big vacuum cleaner? V says, ABH Jackie palette also have some colors that are not safe for eyes. Mmm. Hmm. So you're talking about the um, Anastasia Beverly Hills um, X Jackie palette that she did. Why do they do that? Josh says Tart used to do that too, saying there's now um, black Tart that's shaking my head. Mm-mm. Yep, Tarts palettes. Um to me they're all the same. Light. They don't have any um bold or deep colors. Not even uh cool colors like blues and greens or warmer colors like um, fuchsia or raspberry and things like that. They might have a raspberry in one of their palettes. Um, I don't think I've ever seen orange um, or black, I don't think, in their palettes. Josh says, yeah, Jackie's palette scratched my eyelids. Oh, wow. I wonder what they put in it. B says yes at Josh Loves Beauty. That's that's horrible. So this is the one that you use, Josh. So I'm gonna um I'ma try it out and then I'm gonna play around with the uh foundation. Now is that a powder foundation 
or is it a liquid? It's probably a liquid. Yep, um, yep, I asked you guys that because most of the times, like, um, women who have maturing skin, they like to use things that have hyaluronic acid in it. Um, that's very popular to um, improve the appearance of your skin, like, especially like wrinkles and fine lines. And so a lot of people like to have that in their products, if possible. B says, Red December, I'm so sorry. There are so many sick and crazy people out there. Yeah, B, that, that thing too, uh, that Brown Brows posted on our Instagram page, that was horrible what they did to that young lady. I'm going to tell you guys about it. Um, Brown Brows, her name is Michelle, too. She's in the makeup group, you know, how we post every month. She had put um, a small news video on our Instagram page that we have that we communicate with when we do our looks. And it was a young lady, a uh, very pretty um who had went into the store after work and it was dark i don't know exactly what time it was it might have been five or six or something i don't know she went into the store to get a bottle of wine after work and uh, when she went in there were some guys standing outside the store and they saw her go in so um they came in and one of them offered to buy her wine for her and she was like no that's okay i can um i can pay for it i appreciate it and so um the guy got upset like what's wrong with you you think you better than me or something like that or better than us and she was like no she's like i just want to you know purchase my own wine so she did purchase it as soon as she went outside they surrounded her and they attacked her and he actually bit her face you could see like his whole mouth print in her face and they were kicking her and hitting her and beating her and somebody some people started seeing it and started approaching her and so somebody i think told her to hurry up and run and uh so she did but there was a camera outside thank god that um captured their images so um hopefully they'll catch them and lock them up because that that wasn't right you know what they did to her just because she said no i could pay for it myself crazy absolutely crazy josh says let me know liquid drops and you only need a few girl get out of here drops wow that is interesting v says yes that palette Oh my goodness. Okay, yep, I'm going to check into that. So I'm going to leave that tab up. Well, no, I'll remember. And I got my pen today, y'all. So let me write on here the ordinary. So I can check that out. Okay. So, uh, like I said, the reason I asked you guys that, and I'm going to stop sharing my screen for a moment. Um, yep, the reason I asked you guys that is because I was introduced by another channel um, to a place where you can go and select your own ingredients and make your own product and the website is called mix easy i'm gonna read these comments and i'm gonna pull up 
their um website josh says oh my goodness people can't accept no for some reason you right there's no excuse for that praying for brown brows that's so awful no it, it didn't happen to her she posted it it was another lady she saw the article and she shared it with us on our instagram page it wasn't her thank god it was a woman that we don't know it was a like a news clip um that she shared with us on that instagram page and you know they took pictures of her and just to see how he bit her like that red says that's crazy it's very scary in some neighborhoods go in a liquor store here in minneapolis you really need to watch yourself right you know what I don't even go to the store now like after dark. If I want something, me and Mr. G, we out early and do whatever we need to do or I'll add it to like a doctor's appointment or something like that um, and we get what we need. Just like out, um, today after church, we went to the store to get like bread, you know, some things that we needed just in case because we don't go out cherry says i gotta run errands but i have heard have y'all heard about the ingredient dmdm high high dentone it's in shampoos and said to cause hair loss oh my goodness no i'm glad you told us about it though but I don't even purchase a lot of uh, shampoos like that. I usually like um, co-wash with conditioners. And if I get like a real big buildup, then I'll use um, Shea Moisture um, products to uh, wash my hair with. Or either uh, I got a soap bar that's all natural i'll use that if i get like a, a heavy build up i don't because shampoo is so drying to your hair josh says oh thank god that she's safe yes yep she's safe yep josh says i don't either uh josh says have a blessed day cherry yes have a blessed day cherry i appreciate you for coming in and spending some time with me. V says, okay, at Cherry. Josh says, there are great products from a fellow YouTuber named EY Beauty. Huh, okay. They're natural products. Love the lip color, Michelle. Oh, thank you. I think I missed one coming yet, Cherry. That's good. It's in Swab. I was using it. Wow. And see, sometimes I, the, I'll buy Swab. It's been a long time. Isn't that something? Well, thank you for sharing that. Did you do a video about that, girl? That would be good to do. Josh says she makes African soap shampoo and her conditioners are made from all natural products. Okay. All right. That's what I figured. Like natural products. A lot of people are going more with, you know, natural products. Okay. So let me. Let me see. Red says, I use suave shampoo. Have you had any hair loss? Or do you know if the bottle has that ingredient on it that Cherry said? Okay, I'm going to take this one down. And I'm going to share my screen again. Oh, wait, let me read this comment first. Josh says she sent me some products to try out and they're posted on her Instagram. You can really see a difference. Okay. I'm going to check that out too. Just say EY Beauty.
Yep, I will check that out. Okay, let me take this comment down and I'm going to share my screen. Share screen, Chrome tab, and I want MixEasy.com share. Okay, so this is the website for MixEasy, and it's an ingredients laboratory. They have products for your face and your hair. So they also have a video, uh, a video, but I'm not going to try to um, play it on how it works. I'll just explain it to you. So um, let's just click on face. And then the, uh, you can look at the products that they have here, like to uh clean your face with or to tone your face with that roller and they have a facial cleanser face cream a gentle face wash so what i got was i want to say i just got the face cream yep i didn't get the eye cream just go down a little bit eye serum no, i didn't get any of those okay so let me go back up I got the face cream. Um, right now it's on sale for $35. I want to say that's what I paid for it too. So what they have you to do is um, choose your skin type. So for me, I put um, normal combination because I really do like my forehead is the driest part of my skin and um maybe right um down my chin the sides of my chin might get a little bit dry and the rest of my skin is normal i i, I get a little oil like when i go to sleep at night and i wake up in the morning i have um just a little bit of oil around my nose so um, when you click on what your skin type is, um, like this one says here, the cream base for normal and combination skin. So this is telling you what is in the base of the product. Rooted in natural avocado, jojoba, and sweet almond oils contains higher care, um, Filler CL and higher care 50. I'm live. That results in a plumping effect. Your skin becomes softer and more elastic, helps to prevent irritation and blemishes. That was my oldest son coming in. You can come in. I was just telling you I was live. Okay, so then you click next. and you get to select you all right um up to five natural ingredients and so they have a huge list of natural ingredients so take for instance if you wanted your skin to be a little bit more firm they have um apple fruit extract if you want to minimize your pores, they have ancient nature extract. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. If um, if you want to uh, get rid of blemishes, they have arnica extract, relieve irritation, burdock extract, nourish and soften, propolis extract, relieve flaking, marshmallow extract. So that's just to give you an example, okay? So I'm going to come back over to you guys where the comments are. Let's see. Beautiful natural makeup. Hi, how are you? I see you in the comments. I see your name because that's in bold. Let me just come up a little bit.
Red says, yes, I was wondering why I have clunks come out after each hair wash. Are you serious, girl? That could be why. Josh says, I went from a Jackson 5 Afro to smooth and moisturize. Okay. Wow. Yeah, I'm going to check that out. Like, my hair is soft. I have soft, fine hair. Um, so I would want something that would help to like maybe plump up my strands if possible. I don't know if that's even possible, you know, at my age. I really don't. Oh, goodness. Beautiful Natural Makeup says, hi, my sister. Josh says, hi, Beautiful Natural Makeup. V says, hello, beautiful natural makeup. Josh says, mine is the sides of the chin also right here. If it's too moisturized, I break out. And if I don't moisturize, then I start flaking. Wow. Um, beautiful natural makeup says, simply makeup, dear. Josh says, off topic, but I must say your son is very handsome. <laughs> say hello. Hey, how y'all doing? <laughs> That's my oldest son. You wanted to make some coffee? No? Oh, okay. Because I was going to say, I'll move my uh, book over if you want to, because I got... Uh, um, okay, thank you. Go. Um, I got a number I can give you. Give me one minute, guys, and you can call and they can tell you. No, online. It's online. I'll find it. Oh, okay. Make sure you type this number. Say talk to that. We're talking. Okay. Remember. All right then. Okay. okay. Did you, did you ever get a carrot? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Josh says she even sells rice water packets, so there's no guesswork. Okay, thank you. Yeah, I got to uh, check that out. I, uh, does When you mix it up, does it have a um uh, what kind of scent or fragrance does it have i should say because i heard that the rice water is not a pleasant scent once you make it up And I've never tried on my own to make rice water, but um, I am going to try to make something else that I saw. I'll tell you all about that. Josh says, no orders because she adds all natural herbs in it. Okay. All right, then. That's good. Hey, Linda, the New Orleans gardener. Hey, Michelle. Hello, everyone in the chat. It's good to see you, hon. Welcome. How's it? How's your weather there? In the in the saints land. <laughs> OK. So I placed an order with Mix Easy. And I'm going to tell you, I got um, the fragrance of honey and milk because you can add a fragrance if you want. But I put the calendula extract, the marshmallow extract, the apple fruit extract, 
hyaluronic acid and rose hip extract so i'm gonna go back over here so i can explain to you each thing so the apple fruit extract that one was for firmness and what else did i get come down some oh this one relieve flaking i got the marshmallow extract um because for some reason like on my hairline because that's a part of your skin too around your hairline i my skin flakes so i have to make sure that all that skin is gone before i do a makeup look and um sometimes right on the edges of my eyes my skin will flake so the marshmallow extract the apple fruit extract uh calendula where is that one at and what does it do i'm trying to remember uh uh granite rose hip where is Calendula? Oh, here it is here. Calm, sensitive skin. That's what the Calendula is for. And the rose hip is to give your skin a dewy looking appearance. And then I got the hyaluronic acid. And you know that's for like wrinkles and fine lines. So those were the five ingredients that I chose. So after I chose my ingredients. Okay, I'm just going to choose five so the, I can hit the next button. So I'm just going to do even skin texture. So I'm going to add that one. Uh, that's pomegranate extract. Detox. Um moisturizes and protects the skin so that's bladder bladder rack extract never heard of it i'm gonna add that uh kiwi extract that evens your skin tone i'm gonna add that treat pigmentation is the licorice root extract maybe i should have tried that for my dark spots and you don't have to choose five but since they'll give you up to five i'm gonna select five and elasticity elasticity <laughs> that's the borage extract so i'm gonna check that one okay so i got five so then you come down and say next because it has my five now they want me to choose a fragrance they have sunlight dance bamboo and cucumber they have fragrance free honey and milk and black currant so i had chose the um honey and milk but just for kicks i'm gonna uh, choose the sunlight dance and this looks like citrus and vanilla to me from the picture and then i'm gonna come down and go to next okay so after you do that formula name so this means what do you want your bottle to say and so what did i name mine age grace folds secret That's what I name mine. And then you can add it to the cart. Okay, so I'm going to come back over to you guys. Let's see. Josh says, hi, New Orleans Gardener. Red says, hello at the New Orleans Gardener. New Orleans Gardener says, cloudy, but the Saints family is always great. All right, baby, we can make it through anything and come out smiling. I know that's right, girl. New Orleans Gardener says, hey, at Red December. New Orleans Gardener says, hey, Josh. 
Red says, what a neat website. What is the name again? It's called Mix Easy. Beautiful Natural Makeup says, hi, Linda. Linda says, hey, beautiful. So let's see. I got it like almost a week ago. It was like right after the uh, where we opened up those two mystery boxes. And it just, let me take this comment down. And I will also stop sharing the screen for a moment. This is how it arrived. And they have like a sticker on here that says Mix Easy. So I hope that I just hope they spell my uh, name of my product correctly. <laughs> I said I'll just wait and open it with everybody. And it's in a little bubble wrap. Uh oh. Got this bubble wrap tape down good. Okay, there we go. And it's a pump mix easy face cream oh you know what my name is not on here it says mix easy face cream unique formula Oh, yes, it is so small, though. I thought it was going to be like here. But it's on where the ingredients are. And then it says, age graceful secret. Man, that's a bummer. It's like really small. Down here, the bottom line. Can you guys see it? <laughs> I thought it was going to be on the label. So I'm bummed about that. But at any rate, this is what I mixed for myself. And so whatever you mix, this is how it will appear. It won't be on the front because the front is their name, the Mix Easy Face Cream. I got a light, but I don't know which way to go today. There we go. So let me look at the comments. Josh says, I love your nails. How fun. This is a fun set, isn't it? Because I haven't been to like get my nails done. So I just do them myself um, with the press-ons. And I thought that this was cute and colorful, something different. Josh says, oh, wow. There's my girl. Hey, Pam. Diamond 76, home decor on a budget. Hi, Michelle. I just got home. It's so good to see you. How are you doing? How are you feeling? Red says, it came soon to you. I love it. Yeah, um, it didn't, it didn't take very long. Um, and I didn't know if this was going to come first or if uh, those mystery boxes were going to come first. And I say, well, if I'll just uh, roll with whatever comes um, and then I could present it to you guys. So sometimes these things are locked and unlocked. Maybe that's unlocked. So I'm going to pump a little bit out. See what it feels like. Okay, so yeah. 
If you guys can see it there on the back of my hand, that's the consistency. But it feels light on the back of my hand. I'm just going to tap it in, see what it feels like. It kind of feels just like a moisturizing cream. You know how they're not oily. Um, yeah, it's no oily feeling. It's just like a moisturizing cream. I like how it feels as I tap it into my skin. So I'll probably maybe use this uh, in the mornings, like after I clean my face, because after I get it out of the shower, um, my skin, you don't see any oil on it. <laughs> and so that'll put some back in, especially right now while it's cold outside. Josh says, you got to let us know how well it works. I will. I will. I'm going to use it every day this week, and I'll be able to report back uh, the next time I go live, which is next Sunday. Pam says, I'm doing good, girl. I'm so glad to hear it because I was kind of worried about you. You had a few, you know, snags. Josh says, hi at Pam. Pam says, hey at Josh Loves Beauty. Yep, so I wanted to share this site with you because sometimes um, when we get products, we say, well, maybe it would have worked better if it had something that would do this or if it had that in it. So all these ingredients though for this product are all natural so i don't see it irritating my skin not from the products that i picked out i think it'll be gentle on my skin um, because if i get something on my skin and it's not right i could tell immediately because my face will start burning and I'm like, nope, this product is not for me. No way. Pam says, yes, Michelle, 2021 came in with the big bang. <laughs> I know, girl, I know. Between the uh, vehicle and the hot water tank, Josh says, I'm in Cali and it snowed in Malibu for the first time there today. Really? I didn't hear about that. I I I kind of keep the news on cuz I'm a CNN watcher and um they don't announce a lot about the weather on CNN though. You know, unless it's like something uh huge or devastating then they might talk about it, but they don't talk about too much weather. And I didn't cut on the local news to find out uh, how weather was locally or across the country because, you know, the regular news, they'll talk about things like that. But um, a lot of people, like in warmer places, are having snow. And I said... To myself, probably maybe in like 25, 30 years from now, the weather that Michigan normally gets, which is cold and snowy, we might have more warm weather. And down south, it might be freezing and <laughs> get the snow that we get, you know, the precipitation that we get is crazy. But I think it's just the uh, climate changes that are going on. Diamond said, I mean, Pam says, what, it snowed in Malibu? Oh, wow. That's what I'm saying, too. Soulfoodqueen.net. Hey, Sandra. Hello, everyone. How are you? I wanted to call you after I got home from church, but I kind of ran out of time. And I say, well, if she has time, she'll stop by. Because I didn't know, you know, 
what was going on with you so I didn't bug you but I do need to call you and talk to you a little bit so I'll probably call you after the live but uh, yeah so I found um, this site to be very interesting that you can make your own compound and then uh, you can name it and I thought that that was wonderful but I just am kind of hurt that it doesn't have it you know on the front red says I had to shovel for two hours today but it's understandable because I live in Minnesota right exactly we got snow today too on the way to church it was dry on the way home uh, the roads were fully covered Josh says hi at Soul Food Queen Soul Food Queen says doing good okay I'm glad to hear it Pam says hi at the Soul Food Queen yeah so um you guys just got in here but I was just uh, going over a website called mix easy where you can go in and select the ingredients that you want and put in your product they have products for both the face and the hair so I got a face cream and they call it a unique formula but you get to name it and they put your name on the label but it's very small so my name is on the bottom line I named it age graceful secret this way Michelle so that's what we were going over um, just you know I don't know I hope that the product works and that it's not like gimmicky um, just because you can pick your own ingredients and you can name it whatever you want you know and they put it on the label Sandra says hello Josh beautiful natural makeup says I'm still here watching thank you Sandra says hey Pam so full queens giving the hearts all V says support is leaving JC Penney's and going into Kohl's. Are you serious? Wow. Okay. Kohl's. I don't shop there a lot because they kind of expensive. I thought they would be more like Marshalls and TJ Maxx, but no, they're not. They kind of expensive to me. Sandra says hi at Red. Sandra says hello beauty yep I don't I don't shop there um, very often the last thing I got um, I got on two different because <laughs> uh, I got my ears pierced again so uh, my hole is up higher I had to get them re-pierced because the first time they were ever ever pierced I snuck and I did it myself when my mother was in the Bahamas and my dad or my grandmother made lemonade or iced tea or something I kept the ice and I put it on my ear and uh, I got white thread I knew to do that so it wouldn't be any dye and I got a kind of big needle and I froze my ear and I pierced my own ears so how old was I maybe 14 something like that maybe 14 or 15 so the whole your ears they get old too so the skin is is old and so the hole has stretched so I'm like I can't wear like the bigger earrings like this one which one like this one uh, and I got way bigger earrings too so I couldn't wear them anymore unless I got a hole put up at the top so I did and so I got these light earrings here from Kohl's they were on sale around Christmas and it's a pearl and it's uh, uh, what 10 karat gold and right here on the front it has diamonds and the reason I have on two different earrings is because I need to find my receipt and take them back if possible because um, 
this one does not lock anymore for some reason and the other day I bent over in the refrigerator and it slid out of my ear I heard it hit the floor and slide and it went all the way up under the refrigerator so my son had to dig it out for me and so I put it away now you know so I'll have it and um, I just put an earring in this ear here so I would have something in there I don't want my hole to close up because this is a new hole and and it's not really that new it's over a year old but for some reason it took a long time to heal but after this if I have problems I'm not gonna get another piercing let's see Josh says, I was thinking that they would put specially curated by Age Graceful on the front of the label. That's what I wanted, too. That's what I thought I had in my mind, that it was going to say Age Graceful Secret on the front. And it's down here, fine print on the back. So, like I said, I hope that the product works and that it's not a gimmicky thing. Josh says Macy's is closing in Cali. Wow. It's just what we've been going through for the last year. You know, I'm sure. Red says hello at Soul Food Queen. Red says guess how many ear piercings I have. I had guessed once before. I think it was like 13. Something like that. If I remember right, Pam says, oh, my God, Michelle, my mom pierced my ears with a needle. Really? <laughs> yep. I snuck and did it when uh, my mother and grandmother went to the Bahamas. And I had a plan. I held on to my ice and wrapped it up in a napkin and went up the stairs and went in my mother's sewing kit and got a big needle and the white thread and I put the thread in the needle and I didn't tie a knot of course you have to leave it and I had scissors because you have to cut it once you push it through and then tie that white thread and then you clean it with alcohol put Vaseline on it and you turn the string every day for a week after the first week you take the thread out but you have to have a broom the straw brooms you take something from the top and you get a piece of that and you cut that and burn the ends and soak it in alcohol and then you put that in your ear and you wear that straw for a couple of months and you keep changing the straw because it absorbs like the pus and things like, like that and um, once it absorbs all the pus then you can start wearing earrings and so after I pierced my own my mother she just she was like I'm in the Bahamas and you ain't watching this child and she done pierced her <laughs> Oh, goodness. So then my sister wanted hers pierced and my mom took her to the doctor to get her ears pierced. She should have uh, let me do it. <laughs> it saves a little bit of money at the doctor. Josh says, I used a clothespin to numb it and did it too. See, that's that's our age group. <laughs> So a lot of people did use the clothespins with that spring in it uh, and it just pinch and numb it. But I don't think that clothespin is enough. I don't. I had to have the ice. I, let me see. Yep, I pierced. Did I do it twice for my second hole? Yep, I think I did my second hole too. You know how you wear the two earrings. And then after that first one started stretching out and getting too big, then I went and got a professional piercing, but they still put it too close to the one that was already open. I didn't feel comfortable wearing that. So I went back and I'm like, is it any way you can go way up high and put me another hole in? 
And she was like, yeah, I can do that. Um, and then I got like a belly ring. What was that? Like, how old is my grandson? When I became a grandmother, I got a belly ring. That was, let me see, did I get the belly ring first or the tattoo? They was around the same time. It, I was I was younger. I got my belly ring. I don't know if it's still open, but I still have all my jewelry for that. I'm lucky I didn't get a keloid. That's what my mother said. She was like, I didn't want you to get a keloid. You know, those big things. She was like, I don't want my... Uh, daughter that had those big lumps on her ears, but I didn't get it. So she watched my ears to see how they would react. And then once mine healed up and I started wearing earrings, then she went on and got my sisters done. Pam says, I know right at Josh. Yep. We pierced our own. V says, calls is expensive. It is. It really is. Red says, what was the cost? I know, I think it was the 35. Is it on here? Nope, it's not on here what I paid for it. It just says payment through PayPal. Anything I get, I try to use PayPal in case I have some issues with standard shipping. Um, so I, it was somewhere like in the 40s by the time I got done with it, if I remember right. Let's see, Pam says, I'm thankful I didn't get a keloid either. I know that's right because we, you know, could have messed ourselves up if we wanted to look cute. Red says, You're right, you know me well, you know me too well. The 13. Yep, I knew you had 13 piercings. Pam says, my mom mm -hmm. used ice too. Yep. And then you have to get it real cold. Your ear will turn red. Why are you waiting for it to get cold? Let's see. Pam says, just the straw from a broom. Yep. Red says, I have a 10 millimeter hole punch in the cartilage of my ear. Okay. No, I didn't go that far getting, you know, uh, well, I did get it in the cartilage. Let me take that back. I forgot. I had it on, it must have been this side. And that thing hurts. And it took a long time to heal. I tried to tough it out. But back then, the cell phones, um, I would be like this with my phone. And it would like bump it. I'm like, I can't do this in my cartilage. So I um, stopped wearing the earrings there. Pray, love, live. Hey, doll, how are you? Hi, everyone. Josh Loves Beauty says, hi, pray, love, live. Soul Food Queen says, you can use a clothespin, too. Yep, that's what we were talking about, the clothespins. It was either the clothespin or the ice. Pam says, wait, wait, a belly ring, Michelle? Yep, mm-hmm. I told y'all, I could tell y'all some stories, I tell you. Red says, you need to go to a tattoo shop with a professional ear piercer if you get any more piercings. No, you know, I think I'm done. I'm done. I'll be 65 this year, so I'm, I think I'm done. Josh says, I have six earrings and the rest are body piercings, although I pierced my nose when I was 15 with the same clothespin, young and dumb, but I still have it really. Now, see, I never did that because I know, what well, number one, I know my parents would have had a fit. That would have been totally unacceptable for me to have like a earring in my nose but now they have earrings like 
and a tongue and piercings in the tongue uh right here i don't know how they get it right here that's real deep like almost like dennis deep i've seen piercings there then they have it like in the eyebrow um you know just all over the place piercings pray love there says i will i miss everyone what's for dinner i'm gonna fry some chicken when we get offline yep i'm gonna fry some chicken josh loves beauty says nope can't do the cartilage my sister has her tragus pierced and i'm scared it's going to fall in her ear so you talking about right in here Red says it can take a year to heal ear piercings. My ear punch, they took a whole large circle out of my ear in the cartilage. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> no, that's too much. Ash says, yep. <laughs> Red says, I have three Trugus piercings. Okay. All right, then. See, we learn a lot about each other when we're um, here together. <laughs> yep, I sure did have um, my belly uh, button pierced. It was the same year my grandson was born, and he turned 21 this year. No, last year. He'll be 22 this year. That's so hard to believe. It just seemed like he just grew up so fast. And I don't care how old he gets. And still, Granny Shell's baby. I don't know. I guess I can throw this away. If I want to reorder. Um, did I write down my password? I think they had me make an account. I don't know. Maybe I'll hold on to that. Or if I'd like it and reorder, I might try a different mixture. Red says the belly button I couldn't do out. You know what? It wasn't that bad, though. I actually had it done twice. But I can't tell you the reason on here why I had to get it done twice. <laughs> hey, Finland. Hi, all. Amazing Space Music is from Finland. Josh says, my goodness, Red, aren't you scared? Josh says, belly actually isn't bad. It's really quick. It is. It is. It's a real quick process. And, you know, you pick out which one you want. And they have, like, a gun just like for the ears and i just had to uh like lay on this like a reclining chair i think it was when they did it and um got it done <laughs> pam says what twice and she's laughing yeah i had to get it done twice Yep, I sure did. In a in a different spot though. I had to get it. It was like close to it, but a different spot. Josh says you just can't go swimming for at least 30 days. Well, I don't swim anyway. I never learned how to swim. I always wanted to learn how, but I never did. Never did. I'll get in the water though, like on the low end and walk around in there. And 
the only thing I learned because my gym teacher made me get in the pool and she made me get in the deep end of the pool to uh, learn and she had me to float on my back. She taught me through it how to float on your back and you have to make sure that your head is back and your ears are in the water. If your ears come out of the water, you are no longer floating on your back and you have to arch your back and keep that position until you're actually floating. My problem is, uh, you know, the getting up part because you so, you know, the buoyancy, you know, of your body weight. And I always had a hard time coming back up from floating uh, to get on my feet. So if I'm, I'm not going to float in the uh, beach, but I'll float in a pool, but I'm going to be against the wall so I can hold on to the wall to help me get up. I just, I struggle. I struggle with that. And um, I think like we took the kids to the beach and stuff like that, but I don't know how good of a swimmers that they actually are. Look, Rachel Flowers, Play Emerson, Lake and Palmer. Okay, amazing space music. I'm gonna have to come over to your channel and see what you're talking about because this is your first time over here yes yeah, so i'm gonna have to check that out josh says i come from the time when parents would throw their kids in and see if they would sink or swim. <laughs> Thanks, Mom, for that trauma. Oh, my goodness. Are you serious? They put you in? And see, I think I got scared, too, because in summer school, I was just sitting on the side of the pool, and I didn't want to get in. I had my feet in, and this mean girl came and pushed me in. Almost said something else again. But anyway, when I got out, she ran. She knew she knew to run. She knew that much that she shouldn't have done it. I'm just gonna put it that way. Because she ran and I couldn't find her. And she never came back because I was waiting on her. It was a summer program where you could go for an hour to the local high school and go swimming. And um, I would go, and every day I go, I would be looking for her, but she didn't come back. Josh says I was flung in. Oh, oh girl, no, 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 no. Mm -mm -mm. It is so amazing to me to see babies swim. Um, they have, you know, instructors and the parents get in the water with them and get them used to the water and they do different exercises like teaching them how to float or if they go in face down, how to flip over. And I watched that baby and the, the little thing was in the water, but smiling and face getting wet. That's another thing I'm scared of, my face getting wet and it going up my nose. But the baby knew how to hold her breath and she went in on her face. Next thing you know, she flipped up and she was floating on her back and just smiling. I'm like, wow, really? That is so cool to me. Julia Beauty and Style. Hi, how are you? Welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. What about yourself? 
Thank you for coming. I appreciate that. Amazing Space says, Rachel is blind. Okay. All right, then. I guess when I get over to your channel, I can see what you're referring to. Yep. Um, yeah, um, Julie, uh, we were just going over a website that I introduced the group to called Mix Easy, where you can go in, pick your own ingredients to come up with a formula for everything from eye cream, face cream, shampoo, conditioner, and you pick your own natural ingredients and the website is called Mix Easy. And when you're done selecting your ingredients that go into the base, you can name it. I thought the name was going to be on the front of the bottle, but they actually put it on the very last line on the bottom. I named it Age Graceful Secret and it's down at the bottom here. Which way am I going? Yep, this way. Very small, and it just says Age Graceful Secret. But it was kind of cool to um, be able to select my own ingredients and to name it, even though it's very small. But um, the ingredients, like, say, for instance, marshmallow extract or the uh, apple fruit extract, it tells you uh, what ingredients, um, what they're good for. So it was something different. Josh says, I was not smiling. Uh, it hit the side of the pool and still have the scar under my chin. No, no, that was too big of a fling into the pool. Oh, girl. Julia says, I am good. Great, great. See, uh, amazing space music, Stevie Wonder 2. Okay, so now it seems like maybe you have different music on your channel. Okay, because you had several names written down. Yeah, I'll have to check that out. Julia says, oh, we'll check the site out. Hopefully not so expensive. Uh, it's moderately expensive. It was $35 for this one. Then you have to pay uh, your shipping cost as well. i tell you, I don't know which way to go. <laughs> yeah, Mix Easy is MixEasy.com is the website but when you get it the box says duval brands incorporated and it says clearwater florida it doesn't but it does have uh mix easy stamped on the box on the front of the box so it's a product from uh florida Pray Love Live says your nails are pretty. Oh, thank you. Yep, I was showing people earlier. I did this set myself. Um, who are these by Kiss? The, the press on nails. And I did them this morning before church because I got up early. I get up early so I can like sometimes put on makeup. Um, before I go to church, but today I did my nails. So Food Queen says, how about a cellulite cure? Hmm. Huh. I wish it was a cure for that. Pam says, oh no, at Josh. Yeah, that was kind of mm-mm. 
that'll leave you feeling, you know, leery the rest of your life about getting in the pool because of that experience. It's a traumatic experience. Julia says, what is the site link so I can check it out? Let me see if I can grab it and share it. Uh, hold on for one second. back one more there we go is that all it's gonna say huh thought it would have had a URL but it doesn't yep that's it Josh says, true story. That is a wild story. Sandra says, sell you like cream. Yeah, they got a lot of creams and stuff, but a cure? I wish it was a cure, girl. Pam says, I am so sorry at Josh. That is, that's, that's too much. Too much. Olavi says, thank you. Oh, no problem. Yep, if um, people don't know each other, you know, you can introduce yourself by going to someone else's channel and checking out their content. Julia says, do they have, have for hair products too? Yep, it's uh, for your face and hair. And you can select your own ingredients up to five. They do have a base, though, and they'll show you in the base according to, like, say, for instance, for your face, if you have oily combination or dry skin, um, they have a base, and then they'll give you the um, a listing of all the ingredients that they have to offer with a description up under the ingredients so that you can find things that are suitable for your skin or your situation, which I found very, very different, you know, and like I said, I just hope that it's not gimmicky and that the product will actually work. Natural hair products. Yeah. Everything is natural. Josh says, thank you at Diamond or Pam, I should say. Oh goodness. Pray Love Live says, Oh my God, you did a great job. I love press songs. I do too. They have like some really nice sets these days. And um I also get sets from um Amazon. Amazon has a few nice sets and I'm I don't know. Um, this set right here, I like how playful it, the colors are, but the only thing I didn't like is that they didn't have a lot of them with the stones, and they didn't have a lot of or even mixture of the smaller sizes and the larger sizes, because uh, my nail beds, they're not real, real big, but um, they're big enough. Okay. My granddaughter texted me. I hate using anti-age products because of the chemicals. So this website looks great. I have never heard of anything like it. Yeah. Yep, 
that's why I liked it too because my skin is sensitive and so I said oh they got all natural products that I can add you know um, to my own base which I think is cool amazing space music says hi friends Pam says all oh, at Josh that's the uh, link Twenty, hey baby, hello all. It's good to see you. How's it going? Olavi says hi, soul food queen. Twenty says hey, Michelle. Julia says thanks for the link. Oh, you welcome, baby. No problem. No problem at all. Soul food queen says hello. Simply You Makeup says, I love nails, but cannot work with them. Yep, I'm accustomed to them. And I, and I even wear some that are longer than this sometimes, depending on what video I'm going to be doing. But the ones that are real long, I have to be real careful. I don't poke myself in the eye because I've come close a couple of times, you know, either putting on lashes or maybe doing concealer or something like that when I get in tight and I'm like, oh, oh no, to be real careful. Olavi says, good Sunday evening. Greetings from Finland. Well, we're glad that you're here from Finland. Pam says, Michelle, I've got to start cooking. Have a blessed night, Michelle. You too, Pam, and thank you so much for coming by to see me. I feel better now that I know you're okay because you've been on my mind. Twenty says, good to see you all. Oh. Let's see. Pam says, good night, everyone. Good night, Pam. Stay safe, girl. Josh says, good night and God bless. Olavi says, sorry, no subway. Good Sunday. I knew what you meant. I knew. I think they did too. So that's no problem. We're human. We make typos. Pam says, oh, thank you, Michelle and Josh. Yep. We love you over here. And we want you to be safe. Okay. What time is it? 4.43. So, the next thing I'm going to say, I need for you guys to um, check my channel this coming week. Uh, number one on Tuesday, we drop in our uh, Pantone Color of the Year video with the Beauty Over 40 Makeup Collab group. And we have a new member, which is V. Simply You Makeup Channel is joining us. So welcome. We're so happy to have you. If there's anybody else interested in joining the Beauty Over 40 uh, makeup collab group, just let me know and I'll put you in touch with Lavinia, who is our coordinator director. She's the founder of the group and um, she can set you up. You do not have to be a makeup artist. I am not a makeup artist. I'm just a regular everyday person who likes to play in makeup. So makeup is you know for fun like i always say your face is like a blank canvas and you are the artist and then what you put onto your face is your art and every piece of art is different so people are going to be different so we encourage anybody who wants to join in the group to join no problem. Let's see. Andrea said good night. Beautiful natural makeup says sorry. I leave and just come back. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. No problem at all. Yeah, because I know we have life to live, right? 
Yep, so that's the first thing to look for is that video on Tuesday. We usually put it out at 7 Central Time, so it's 8 Eastern Time for me. Uh, she likes to get the videos out at least by that time. Sometimes we put them out a little bit early. I know Brown Brow, she likes to put hers out a little bit earlier. But Tuesday is the day. We always do it the last Tuesday of the month. And the second thing is I'm going to be doing um, the cash um, app giveaway. And this giveaway is um, in honor of our upcoming wedding. You know how I wanted to have you guys like participate last year when it, the wedding was supposed to be. Um, last May, but we had to postpone because of the virus. So we'll be getting married this year. So um, I'm going to be putting out a video explaining um, a little bit about that. So I wanted you guys to look out for that because you are my loyal and loved on supporters. I appreciate you guys. So I wanted you all to know about that giveaway to look out for that and um, that's it um, coming up right now just look for those two little videos and we'll talk about more uh, next Sunday so Food Queen says welcome back and beautiful simply you make them says thanks Michelle I'm so excited to be part of the beauty over 40 well we're happy to have you I know I am happy that you consider doing it you know after I asked you um did, would you like to participate it's gonna be fun it's gonna be fun you, you'll enjoy it a whole lot I enjoy the girls they're so sweet um you know we built, you know, like a relationship. Um, uh, I like to call it a YouTube ship. <laughs> and I like, I like them all. They're very sweet, very knowledgeable, intelligent ladies, mature women. I'll put it like that. Mature women. So, um, you all look out for those those videos and on V's channel as well since she's in the group, you know, to give her a little bit of support. Um, well, actually, it's three things, but um, no, it's just the two. It's just the two for right now. I'm talking. I'm talking a little bit too much. <laughs> Oh, goodness. So that's it, guys, for today. Is there anything else you guys want to talk about or ask about? Just let me know. Josh says, I got to leave for Bible study. Love you all. Love all you ladies. Stay safe and God bless. Okay, baby. Thank you for coming. Enjoy Bible study. Um, that's different to have Bible study on a Sunday. That's cool. That's cool. You get church twice in a day. We um stop doing our Bible studies for right now. We just, you know, doing the church part. They did add the uh, church school and then the regular service, I should say, but no uh, Bible study yet. It'll be probably coming soon. B says, Michelle, check the end key products. Okay. Let me write that down and then I'm going to go to the website and key. Give me one second. OK. 
Okay. The nkeylist.com skin and hair care. Okay, this is a nice website. Can I close this out? Where is the X? Okay. Let me um bring up the stream yard and share the screen with you guys. Okay, so this is the N key list spotlight ingredients for breakouts. At the N key list, we're passionate about empowering people with knowledge. We know that when it comes to breakouts, blemishes, and acne, it can often be confusing to know what ingredients to use as everyone's skin is different. Through knowledge, we are here to help empower you to better understand your skin and the ingredients that will help treat and clear blemishes and breakouts for all skin types. So that's like their little mission statement. And we got a video here, lady using the product. And it looks like she has a facial wash and then some type of cream that she's putting on the acne. I saw something about cat. It went so fast. I don't know if I saw caffeine or not. But anyway, um, I know that sometimes caffeine is used in some products. Yep, caffeine eye cream. It kind of stimulates the skin. I had a cup of caffeine coffee yesterday. I had got a deal on some uh, pods for the Keurig. <laughs> and I drink decaf, but the coffee is hazelnut, and I went on and drank one. And I was like, Speeding around the house doing stuff. It was so funny, but I'm just glad it didn't make my heart rush. So um, I'm going to go into skin. Recipe Builder Skin Concerns Our Products. So I'm going to hit Recipe Builder because this sounds um, similar to... Um, the mix easy build your recipe answer a few questions and tell us a little bit about your skin and we'll recommend the right products for you okay so they recommend the products or take a look at our products so i'm gonna go that way take a look at what they have right quick so this is all the products that they have and the site is very similar to the Mix Easy site in terms of like um, the products, but the products just might not have the same ingredients. Turmeric moisturizer, alpha hydroxy acid to even skin tone and texture. This one here that just went dark, $10.99. Then they got the C50 Blemish Night Cream. I didn't mean to touch that. Um, $12.99. That's not too bad. And I'm not sure what this is supposed to be a picture of. If it's supposed to be a little bit of the product. And that's the inside of the box of the product. So that's a keeper. Until you, you know, get used to the product. Okay. That's how it's coming out. It's a clear product. Okay. A clear serum. I should say. 
that you use at night for your skin. So that's pretty cool. And what does it say down here? Reduce breakouts and blemishes and it's a treatment. That's what they have highlighted here. To treat the skin. And then they have a very long list of all the ingredients. That's a lot of ingredients. Do we really need that many ingredients? You all see that list? Good gosh, that's a lot, a whole lot, but sometimes people want the most. <laughs> Every, anything they can get, let's see. Sandra says, V, I subscribe to your channel. All right. Adrian Slays, hey, how are you doing? What's going on with you? Welcome. Happy New Year. <laughs> how are you feeling? Because I know you've had a, a, I got a package. Thank you. I don't even know what it is. And it's wet from the snow. I can't remember what I ordered. B says, thank you very much at the Soul Food Queen. Yep, so the, it, the site appears to be similar um, to the Mix Easy site. So that's cool. Um, and the prices seem like comparable to the mix easy site but i only see products i don't see um where you can you know mix anything though hmm Discover the new Sakunic Acid Acne Treatment now. I don't I don't get a lot of acne. I want to say the older you get, you don't get as much acne. What do you guys think? You guys still get a lot of acne? Like I'll have a breakout. But I've never had like a real big problem with um with acne. And I'm gonna stop sharing this screen. Oh, I know what it is. Okay. I had to think about it. I was going to open it, but I won't. Well, if I'm not getting a response, so maybe no one has asked me how about that, <laughs> which is a good thing, which is a real good thing. But I'm sure that most of us, like, you know, will have episodes where something will break us out whether we eat something and have an allergy or you put something on your face that has an ingredient that your skin just doesn't like it happens it happens 
V said, I get breakouts, but not acne. Yep, that's what I was going to say. I, for some reason, I think um, like acne is more like a hormonal thing, um, especially like in teenagers. And I didn't have acne, but I had a very big breakout. Like, I didn't have a clear spot on my face. I just had all red bumps after I had um, my oldest son, the one that Josh said was handsome. <laughs> and he'll be 45 in March. And after I had him, my face just broke completely out all over. Like I said, not a clear spot on my face. And it just, it lasted maybe maybe two weeks, but it was my hormones. And then with my youngest son, he didn't have a clear spot on his face. He got it, not me. So I guess he took in the hormones. <laughs> So I didn't have to deal with it twice, but his skin cleared up and neither one of my children had uh, like pimples. Like, you know, during the teenage years when the uh, children tend to get the pimples because it's their hormones. And then some people have blemish problem all their life, you know, that they deal with. And so those are the ones that seek to use a whole lot of these types of products. And um, if it's not a moisturizer with maybe a little hyaluronic acid in it, then I'm not really interested in it except for this product here with all natural ingredients did interest me. But I'd be willing to bet and say that all the creams that I have pretty much have the same ingredients and probably the same base, you know. So it's nice to know that you can go to websites like these and get something a little different for a change. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, that's pretty much it for today. So, like I said, look out for those um, videos next week, starting Tuesday. Um, they'll be coming out two videos, okay? Very, the second one is the... Um, cash up cash app giveaway around the wedding so i don't want you guys to miss that one for sure and i want you guys to support us um the beauty of 40 collab group on tuesday or any day next week as you get time because I, I realize that people can't like sit up and watch like a bunch of videos in one day but you know, if you know about it and have an opportunity to look for it and um, and watch it, I'd appreciate it. Okay, well, thank you guys, as usual, for coming to spend some time with me on Sunday afternoon for Sunday Skin. I love you all. Be safe and enjoy your week. And I'm going to be looking for content from you guys, too. And Adrian, if you're still here, I'm going to pay you a visit um, as well. Also on Bego, I've been over there watching some interesting stuff. Um, so I'm still over there, but just kind of like observing a little bit. All right, then. You guys take care. V says good night to everyone.
All right. Good night, V. Good night, Red. Good night, Sandra. Good night, Adrian. And Josh is already gone. And I don't know um, if Olavi is still in the room or not. But I'll be visiting that channel um, this week for sure and introduce, reintroduce myself to my new friend because I've never seen that channel. So Fool Queen says, good night. All right. Love you guys. Take care. Bye.